Hello once again everyone, I have returned to actually deliver a video that I was, it's actually kind of surprising for me. If anyone didn't know, I was on vacation for the last two weeks, I went to Spain just to kind of have a rest for a bit. And while I was out there, I happened to get two strikes on my account, so yes, all on the same kind of series. It wasn't as if it was just one series, another series, no, it was the exact same series, just it was on two different days. And the series was Golden Kamui, the manga series, it actually, they actually got me on that one. Which is actually kind of depressing because I actually really did like that series and it's all gone now. And now I have two strikes on my account which actually now doesn't allow me to actually even stream anymore. And one more and I would have got my account disabled. So if anyone didn't realise, I, I actually had a private most of my um, streams that I did for Jojo and also an engineer Tyson as well. Because I found out afterwards that Jojo and Juni Tyson shared the exact same publisher as Golden Kamui. Uh, uh, and those were the people who striked me. So I thought to myself... Just to play it safe, I'll actually private everything so nothing can happen until I get back because I was on vacation so I really couldn't do very much. If my account got disabled or taken down completely, I couldn't do anything. I was stuck, basically. So I thought, okay, I'll private everything to actually kind of keep it, like, safe for a bit. And now I'm back. I actually unprivated part 7 and 8. So those are back up. I'll unprivate part 6 and 5 as days go on as well. And hopefully, possibly, maybe... I'll, I'll actually publish again um, Junior Tide to actually kind of bring that back as well and actually kind of just leave it there. Hopefully that won't take me down as well. But yeah, so I actually can't stream on YouTube anymore until o October the 15th and the 14th, I believe, is when the two strikes get removed. So yes, that does mean in theory I have to go back to Twitch to actually do everything on there. So I can't do manga on YouTube anymore. I have to do manga on Twitch as well because I primarily did manga on YouTube and then did all anime streams on Twitch and uploads to YouTube afterwards. So yes... But the thing is, I actually can't then actually show Golden Kamui on YouTube because if I do show Golden, if I do show Golden Kamui on YouTube, I will be taken down once again. So I've kind of devised a plan to actually kind of get around the whole entire thing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stream everything on Twitch. I actually have the streams up there, and then add, when I'm done streaming on Twitch, I'll actually link the Twitch stream on YouTube. So I'll make a video saying, okay, so if you want to watch the whole entire stream, this stream's on Twitch, and do it that way. To actually kind of alleviate anything that actually can happen afterwards because. I have zero idea whether or not they actually will do it again, but I'm just kind of taking precautions because I don't really want to. I don't really fancy losing three years worth of work just to kind of, just to kind of see it all just go up in flames, basically. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm probably do the exact same thing for JoJo because JoJo does 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 share the exact same publisher as uh, Gon Kamui. So that's gonna be done for the prim primarily for the future, possibly all the time. I don't know. I, I just actually have no idea because. With these strikes, it, it just come at random. They just it, you just don't know whether or not they actually are a tr it actually did in free find fault with your video or it's just them being trigger happy. I don't know. That's the thing because it's a weird it's a weird concept. The whole thing with um with them because a lot of my streams kind of get uploaded once again by other people. I don't know why, but it happens sometimes. And those streams still exist on YouTube. Same thing I have with Overlord. Like my Overlord stream got taken down, but it's the other one that uploaded it again still exists. So it's it's at random. But I've seen a few other people get these strikes from the exact same company, which is Shuisha. So, yeah, that's just, that's what's happened, basically. So, yeah, I'm saying this update video to actually kind of say I'll be gone from YouTube for the foreseeable future. Possibly just, I'll upload, the, I'll upload on YouTube, like, always. But to actually stream on YouTube, I won't be here. So, if you want to actually kind of know what's going on in the world of my streams, then do actually kind of do actually join my Discord server because my Discord server actually will allow you to actually kind of see when all the streams go live on Twitch because I actually always post everything on there. So it's always the best way to actually kind of find out what I'm doing and where I am and also possibly Twitter as well. I'm not too sure, but yeah, so that's what's happened. It was really kind of suckish it happened. It was really kind of suckish it happened on, while I was actually kind of um, on holiday. I was like, great. So you're kind of just taking down all my all my golden Kamu and I'm actually not there to actually kind of save my channel, but I actually managed actually managed to get some internet actually kind of then just private everything on my channel. So it was it was horrible, but what can you do? It happens on YouTube. It's just a, one of those things. I was going to actually kind of counteract the whole entire thing, but again, I don't know what happens with these things. That's the thing. I don't I don't really want to actually kind of submit a count notification and then so I should actually kind of comes back and actually does it again. And at that point my channel goes completely. I have no way to get it back. So <laughs> it's just it's a it's a thing as they say. YouTube isn't very much a thing. So yeah. I might also have to dis disable a lot of things to do with my streams as well, just actually kind of just say so, just to stay safe completely because I just don't know. YouTube YouTube has just gone gone down the route of 
if you're you're not safe in any way in anything you do because I've seen people get these strikes just using pictures. So it's one of those things that I don't think that it was it was manually detected. I think what happened was Suasha kind of went on YouTube, saw all these videos, and actually went, "Yeah, these this is not right," and it's just probably striked it that way. I just have no idea. It just kind of seems that kind of seems the most likely of all plausible reasons because if you if you kind of look at what happened, it makes sense. But hell if I know, I'm not um I'm not a publication company. I don't know. But yeah, so as as I said, in to resume the whole entire video of me kind of talking, basically, yeah, I won't be on YouTube until October the fifteenth, and I will also, I will be on Twitch the whole entire time, so yeah, best way to actually kind of find out is via Discord server, that actually doesn't really tell you everything, also Twitter does as well, Twitter's actually a good place to go as well, so yeah, until October the 15th, I have indeed been the driver, and I'll see you guys later, bye for now.